Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, my name is Brogan. It looks like I have no hair. Can you see that? It's up in a bun. Anyway, today I'm going to show you how I achieved this look right here. Um, this is just a cute Halloween. What is going on with my eyelashes? Okay, anyway. Today I'm going to show you how I achieved this look right here. Um, just a fun Halloween half jack-o'-lantern look. Um, so yeah, um, I'm just going to jump right into it. Let's... Oh, all my lights are in the way. Er, okay. So to start out, I am going to put some of this priming moisturizer from... For, oh, <laughs> I'm struggling today. Um, from First Aid Beauty all over my face because I just had some other makeup on that I took off. So my face is a little bit dry from that. And plus this stuff smells really good. Okay, and then next I'm going to throw on my favorite primer ever, the No Pore Blum um, primer from Touch and Soul, and just shove that all over my face. Okay, and then actually for my like base of the orange side, I'm going to stick some foundation on, I believe. What am I do? Yeah. So I'm just going to use my L'Oreal Infallible foundation. And I'm just going to put it on the part of my face that I'm working on right now. Okay, I think I'm at a slightly different angle now, but I think it'll be okay. Let's actually push this back a little farther. Okay, so what was I saying? Yes, I'm going to take my James Charles Morphe palette and get the whoop, orange color from here for just putting pretty much all over that side of my face. So... Just gonna do that with a giant um, eyeshadow brush. And I kind of mix the shades 518 and Rusted, but more of the 518 okay, color. Wow, this is the struggle today. My setup is not ideal. Okay, let's do this. My skin's going to be dyed orange for days. Okay, next I'm going to just do the, like, black lines that go down just before I do anything else, just so it's all in place. It's easier to do the background stuff before doing um, the rest of the stuff. So I'm just going to go ahead and do that next, and I will just use the shade, I think it's called Spooky, from the James Charles Morphe palette with just a, you know... A brush like this from Luxie. It's the mini round brush and I will use that to just kind of buff that, uh, not buff, but like put that into my face. So yeah, let's go ahead and do that. This is not turning out very well, but I'll keep going. Actually, yeah, my Mellow Cosmetics 
liquid black eyeliner to make the um, triangle eye and to make the nose and mouth. And my camera's gonna die. All right, so my camera died in the middle of that. So what I did is I finished up the mouth and the nose with just black eyeshadow and black eyeliner. My eye is watering so much. I think these lashes are gonna fall right the frick off. Wow. My eyes are literally watering so much. Anyway, um... Holy crap. Anyway, and then I put um, foundation on this side. Just some eyebrow. I did black um, eyeshadow and then just the same orange. And then I popped on some fake lashes. And if my eyes stop freaking watering, I will put this mascara on. Wow, all of the makeup is falling off of the eye. Why is it watering so much? Okay. Anyway, and now the finishing touch is going to be taking the eyeliner and making little, like, X's for stitches across the spots where it meets with this, so, like... My eye is just freaking watering up a storm. What the heck? I didn't even like get anything in my eye either. What the frick? All right, anyway, so this is the finished look. Um, I don't really exactly love how I did the, um, like the pumpkin lines right here. They look a little like a basketball, but this is my first time doing this ever, so I think it turned out pretty well for it being my first time and for me not being like a professional makeup artist or anything like that. Sorry, I keep playing with my hair. But yeah, so that's the finished look. <laughs> um, so here you are, a jack-o'-lantern type thing. Um, yeah, so obviously with more practice, this could look better. But, like I said, I think it looks good for it being my first try. Alright, so thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you liked this video, you should give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe. Thank you guys and have a wonderful day.